Well, it's a state you. of mind and the perspective you bring to this hearing, and I think the American people understand. Let me ask you this then. Did you give advice to Lanny Davis or Michael Cohen prior to Mr. Cohen's testimony to Congress? No. Well, you said on Aaron Burnett's uh, show the night before Mr. Cohen testified in front of the Oversight Committee that Michael Cohen should, you said you had talked to Lanny Davis and that Michael Cohen should hold his testimony as long as possible from Republicans. You didn't say that to Mr. Davis? You said well, it on, on Aaron Burnett's show the night before well, Mr. I Cohen didn't testified. Say, I didn't say it uh, directly to Mr. Cohen was your question. No, it wasn't. My question was, did you give advice to Lanny Davis or Michael Cohen had, prior I've, to Mr. Cohen's testimony to Congress? Yeah, I have known Lanny Davis for almost a couple decades, uh, and we have talked about it. And I did say, uh, as soon as you turn your testimony over, it will be picked apart. So you instructed Michael Cohen's lawyer to keep information from Republicans, to obstruct <laughs> the committee work that we were doing on the Oversight Committee just a few months ago? You, you told that to M Michael Cohen's lawyer? Uh, I didn't quite phrase it that well, way, no. You know what? They took your advice. I'm sorry? They took your advice. Did they? Yeah. I Mr. Didn't Mr. Know Cohen that. kept his testimony from us for as long as possible. But you know what else Mr. Cohen did that day? Lied. Lied seven times. And this is, this is what I think concerns so many Americans. This is what concerns, I think, so many Americans about the work that's going on in this Congress, this 116. The first, the first announced witness of the 116th Congress was Michael Cohen, a guy who sits in prison today for lying to Congress. Today, Chairman Nadler brings in front of the Judiciary Committee a guy to talk about obstruction of justice who went to prison in 1974 for obstructing justice. I did not go to prison. Okay. You pled guilty to obstruction of justice. I'm glad you got to stay out of prison then, I guess. What